But the problem is this, guys. A person can have the characteristics of narcissism, but not suffer with that mentality. Look at yourself. I can look at myself. I do possess a lot of narcissistic traits. But in order to be a strong, believing Muslim, you have to have those traits. Because the thing about narcissists, these people are not weak, they're strong. And that's how the Arabic men were. They were a strong warriors, strong race of people. The women were strong too. But the problem is when you put two narcissists together, they'll bump, they'll bump, they'll bump, they'll bump. And that's why marriage was very hard to maintain for them and still is today for many of us because many of us are strong believers. Many of us have characteristics of narcissism. I do. Most women in my website have some of the characteristics. We don't have them all. And what keeps us from having them all is Islam. And that's what happened with the Arabs. The Arabs were a very narcissistic race, women and men. But when Islam came, Islam brought about balance. That's the thing. Islam is all about balance, okay?